Welcome, welcome, welcome. Court here. This is going to be for Virgo. My Virgos, my Virgos, sipping on Merlot. Got a wedgie. All right. So blunt. Super blunt. All right. Um, my mind just went in the gutter. Uh, not in the gutter like that. I just, I was thinking about smoking a blunt. I don't smoke blunts anymore, but uh, it brought me back to a discussion I need to have with somebody because I saw a whole bunch of, a whole bunch of blunt ashes in the ashtray. So there's that. Sorry, I got totally sidetracked. I don't know if maybe you guys are dealing with some children here or, you know, just yourself. I feel like someone's getting yelled at for not cleaning out the ashtray. Um, anywho, I don't, it's almost like I wanted to start that video over, but I'm not. You're going to see my face this week. People are taking my content. Not a big deal. I'm glad you appreciate it. But this is me, court here, okay? Um, Virgos, I'm actually really liking your energy right now. It's very, um, I almost said suspicious, which is very odd because my Virgos aren't usually suspicious. You can be. You definitely can be. I'm, I wonder what your rising is, to be quite honest with you. Um, I don't know if you're worried about offspring. I, I don't know. You're getting a whole bunch of channel messages, my little Virgos. Um, hi. I, I just feel like Ganesha's staring at me today. Hi. You just look so pretty. So I'll put her... I'm going to put her right there for you. She can... I almost said she. Anywho. She can stare at you today even though it's a he. Virgo. Wow. Okay. So let's just... Let's just get down to... What we're about to get down to. What are you about to get down to? I'm loving your energy, though. It's very, um, lots of laughs. Virgo. Week three, June, Virgo. I mean, yeah, there's eyes everywhere. That eye was just staring at me. This eye's now staring at me. I'm turning the book upside down. I don't know if someone's watching you. Oh, jeez, look at Yeah, somebody might be watching you. It's the three of swords. This is past pain. It's, it's pain that's not even here anymore so I don't know if you're holding on to it they're holding on to it nine of cups six of pence knight of cups Virgo the sun and the five of swords sexual seduction again it keeps coming in so be wary three of swords nine of cups six of pence Knight of Cups, the Sun, and the Five of Swords. Uh, you know the past. The past pain is here. I don't. I don't know why. Um, Kind of watch your back. The, the the song I'm getting right now is Ready or Not, Here I Come, You Can't Hide. This is like, I th feel like this is somebody who wants to win at all costs right now. I don't feel like you're dealing with anyone sneaky per se. There could be some arguments this week on a side note, if you're dealing with a Leo. Water sign, air. Yeah. I don't see any fire here. Tell me about this sun real quick. The Empress. Could be dealing with, again, a Leo. This could be you. Something could be faded here. Something long term. 
your own happiness. It's where your happiness lies. You do have somebody trying to come in and trying to explain how they feel about a situation, how they see you, how they look at you. You do have a feminine or masculine here that is looking at something very long term. I don't know if you're worried about the past, so don't worry about it. Let the past be the past. The man's coming in first this week. I, I don't know what that's about. In every card here, the man is coming right toward you or looking right at you. See, like here, he's in front of you, looking right at you, behind you, but looking at you, coming right at you, with you, here's with you too. So I, I, I do... I, I do see positivity here, okay? I do feel like somebody wants to win at all costs too, but I don't think you need to be wary here. I think you know what this is regarding. I don't know if you're kind of waiting for this energy to come at you. And again, I don't see waiting, but um, like if you just have that inner knowing that this energy is going to come at you. There is some type of, somebody does want balance here. Somebody does want to fix something. They want to even the scales. This is somebody who wants to win you back or have your back. You do have a messenger this week. You could be dealing with somebody from your past considering that the Three of Swords is crowning the Knight of Cups. But again, I think you would know this person. It could be like your recent past two days ago, three days ago. You guys definitely, there's, there's definitely passion. If you don't know what this is regarding, you probably meet somebody new, get a message, there's a crush here, a secret admirer, somebody who's been admiring you. So very playful energy. I'm really not worried about the five of swords. Yeah, see it's the chariot. How to how to like win you over, how to be triumphant. Somebody here wants to win you over. That is for sure. I am going to throw you an animal spirit card. The Virgo. Ooh. Elephant. That's ironic because Taurus just had that. So again, there's an obstacle cleared here. And you might be dealing with the Taurus because the Empress came out. So feel free to cross watch. All right, unstoppable. Wise. The elephant, this is like Ganesha, okay, and, and he was just staring at me. The elephant represents the immersed wisdom of good fortune. It's said that the elephant is the great destroyer of obstacles. So if this card appears when you feel stuck, rest assured that your path will soon become clear. To add to the mystery, the elephant is known as the known to create obstacles in order to steer us in the right direction. Trust your gentle, noble creature and eliminates the way the light of self-knowledge. When you're in balance, you're on point, you're focused, you're generous, and you're loving. When you're out of balance, you're misunderstood fate. To bring into balance, you must trust. So you should trust a situation here. It, it seems a little tough that you would want to trust this. I just saw like you, you're, I literally just saw a lot of people's faces like, okay, so if you want to bring it into balance, you need to trust something here. Um, so right now, an obstacle is being removed. Again, there's something faded here. This Empress keeps coming out. She's not a card of fate. 
but she keeps coming out as the card of fate today. So, whatever this is, you definitely went through like a battle. Again, to bring into balance, you're on point, you're focused, you're generous, you're loving. So some of you are in that energy, and I feel it with the majority of you are, okay? So the, the, the out of balance here is probably miscommunication, misunderstood fate, not really knowing what direction to go into. But just whatever direction you're about to go into, trust it. Because it does have a beautiful outcome. And, and somebody is coming at you, whether it's whether it's somebody brand new or somebody from your past. Some of you, I'm, I'm telling you, it could definitely be brand new. And this is how they're looking at you. Somebody could have a crush on you and it's going to get you out of a funk. It's going to make you real happy. I'll tell you that with the because the. The nine of cups, the sun is crowning the nine of cups. So if somebody's coming in, mm, you know, I just see it's more a lot of passion with you guys, so I wouldn't worry about it. Again, this is somebody who wants to win. This is somebody who wants to be triumphant. You could be dealing with a cancer. It's a cancer sign, cancer card. But um, strong Taurus, Leo, cancer. And then you have the elephant. Um... Fire too. The elephant represents fire. Aries, Leo, Sag. So, this is somebody who just wants to win, be triumphant, and not. I don't really see it as a bad thing. It just make sure there's synergy, there's back and forth, common courtesy too. I don't know where that came from. So an obstacle is being removed. Somebody does see something as long term. Some of you, this is a crush. Maybe they need to push through something to come at you. But it looks like you're going to start dating or talking to somebody because this person is pretty determined. The elephant is pretty determined. Okay. So don't let the past interfere with the present moment because whatever this is has a lot of potential. Okay. I love you guys. I will see you on Patreon. Have a kick-ass week.